Welcome to another day of our Christmas castle countdown. Today we're at Bergsatzwe, a castle nearby Bonn, Germany. Today we're also lucky because there's a festival that's going on. And we're even luckier because guess what? It's raining. What's insightful? We've walked around and it's raining. <laughs> we're asking about tours. Like I thought they had them today to actually go inside the castle, but we're waiting to see. We found out that the tours will happen, so we have to wait for about half an hour before we can get our tour. We're about to start our tour. Das Ganze wurde geheizt von diesem Kamin hier. Das war auch die einzige Heizquelle in der ganzen Ritterburg. The man who gave us a tour is like one of the grandchildren of the owner, so like he's still from like the family stem that owns it. And it was really cool because he showed us like actual like swords and like a thing they would use to like move people from out of the way of the horses. It's really cool to meet a part of the family. He said his oldest brother used to had still lived in the castle up until about five years ago when he decided he wanted something more modern and is actually now a hotel. So if you'd like to stay in a castle, this is a beautiful opportunity. The oldest brother of the man who gave us the tour married an American lady and she's a really big book writer so we're going to try and see if she's at this flea market right now and maybe get an autograph because that would be cool. I actually want to find out where she's from in the States. The family that owns this place are gold diggers. <laughs> well, it's true, the family keeps marrying rich people so they can keep restoring the castle. I mean, at least their heart's in the right place. So there was one lady that lived over here in this castle and, well, we all know Beethoven, right? The really big musician in Germany. He dedicated a, a piece yeah, to, to her and there was a kind of dedication frame. frame. <laughs> So wait to say that's fake. That's fake? That's fake. Or that's fake. It was really nice. I liked it because it was also more of a personal experience. We weren't able to see the lady who was like married to the guy who was 
the owner of the bird now. It's really rainy and wet and we just want to go home. You can also sleep here if you'd like and I think it's a really pretty castle. One that you should definitely try to see. And they also have a lot of festivals. So there's something fun for everyone. Lucas? If it's not obvious, I have to do all this while holding an umbrella, one-handed. Um, yeah, I like the castle. It's small. I'm determined. <laughs> they keep wanting to help me. It is small and tinier, but like right now they're doing a festival. So maybe if you're here around like October, you can see the festival. This kind of got like a market, kind of like a Christmas market, but in October. The tour is pretty cool too. And as you saw, we even got to take videos. I do think the tour had a lot of family mm -hmm. tree stuff, That's like true. almost a little too much. <laughs> and he repeated. Yes, like, I thought so too. I was like, is it yeah. just me? <laughs> no, it's not you. There's sometimes like two or three different photos of the same person like in every room and it kind of gets repeated a lot, but maybe he forgot, I don't know. All right, my arm's tired, I'm ending this. Like, comment, subscribe. No, 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 I got it. I'm running in the road like an idiot. Okay, like, comment, subscribe. You guys know what to do. If you want to see more, hit those buttons. See you later. Mark. Camera, there's some water drops on you, but we'll just roll with it. You can stay here if you would like, and I don't even think you're aiming it at me. Oh, yeah. Okay, thanks. And they also do a lot of, uh oh. Ooh, oh. He is. Yeah. Oh, I can't take you anywhere. <laughs>